Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Hunter Binstock. Starting off your Tuesday afternoon one minute forecast, we're taking a look at weather alerts. So we have a wind chill advisory right now over there in eastern Montana. It's for wind chills followed until Thursday at 11 a.m. Mountain Standard Time. Now we can ex expect these advisories to start progressing across North Dakota as the system is moving south. We have that cold Arctic air that's gonna move across the upper portions of the Midwest and we also have a hydrologic outlook. Now it's not on the map here, but it's in central North Dakota around the Bismarck area. Now, right now the Missouri River is at 4.9 feet. It's expected to rise to 9.5 to 12 feet as we have layers of ice that form on the lake, or sorry, on the river, and as they push down the river, it'll cause a sort of blockage and that's gonna cause the river to rapidly rise. Now, when this finally does occur, they expect it to occur within a 24 hour period, so it's gonna go from the 4.9 to potentially nine and a half feet in less than 24 hours. Looking at radar right now, you can see that snowfall that's already pushing into the eastern reaches of Montana and the western portions of North Dakota. So Wilson's going to see it first, then Dickinson. We can exp expect this snow to progress into the state overnight. You're going to see some snowfall accumulations with it, and it's going to work its way across North Dakota into eastern North Dakota by Wednesday afternoon. This temperatures right now uh, are anywhere from the single digits into the teens and 20s for much of the state getting into the 30s down in that southwestern corner 32 in beach 30 in bowman 18 in minot 14 in stanley so those temperatures are cooler and they're going to get a lot cooler over here the next couple of days now our temperature outlook has us quite a bit cooler than the seasonal averages right now we would be expecting like the teens into the single digits but with this incoming system it's kind of throwing a little bit out of whack where we could see those temperatures that are going to be well below zero we're looking anywhere from 10 below zero to even 20 below zero and that's without wind chill looking at our lows tonight we're looking at teens maybe some temperatures below zero we have two below zero over there in minot 14 in watford city 16 in beach so those temperatures are dropping Looking at our snowfall accumulation map, we're going to see trace to one inch for much of the state. And in the more northern regions of the state, we're expecting anywhere from one to three inches. Probably closer to that two inch mark for a lot of the northern regions and out towards Devil's Lake where that system kind of gets stuck for a while. We could see anywhere about four inches. Now find out just how cold the temperatures are really going to get in my four o'clock full forecast.